Okay, the test I'm going to do now is I'm going to fill the backpack sprayer up again, four gallons, and I'm going to test the T plastic T nozzle head to see how many gallons per minute it sprays out. I also added this gallon measurement device into my sprayer here that I'm going to fill it up. So we're going to see at the four gallon mark on the tank, which we know now is correct to see if this meter also matches four gallons. Tank's at four gallons. Not sure you can see that, but that's right at four gallon mark. So it looks like that little meter reads about 5% uh, low. So we'll take that into account when we do final calculations. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to see how many gallons that I can run through this M4 sprayer with this particular tip on, which is going to probably be the more common tip that I would use because it would be used for lawn application of uh, systemic uh, fertilizers and uh, weed killers and uh, what I'm going to do is basically have the pistol on trigger on lock so it'll be constantly spraying uh, we already know that we've uh, put four gallons in it I've got the meter on the the faucet that I'll keep track of gallons that are going in and I'm going to Make sure that the gallons going in will will be about equal to what's going out, and uh, the result will be what we read on here at the very end will be how many gallons were actually sprayed when the battery finally dies. Technically, there's supposed to be about 150 gallons with a full charge, and we'll see how close we get to that. Uh, I understand, you know, brand new batteries, sometimes it takes a few cycles before they really do their top performance, but we'll just see what it is today. Okay, I'm going to get spraying. All right, it's been running for over almost three and a half hours here. And I'm noticing this meter isn't really moving, so I'm just trying to trickle the water in there. It must be this meter, uh, which just for some reason went blank. There it goes. Uh, stops registering if the flow is too slow. So I'm gonna ignore the reading on this meter and we'll just try to figure out how long this battery will run. Try to take a reading when the green light goes out. Go from there. All right, it's almost been four hours. You can see that green light is starting to fade a little bit. I'm going to say the green light is out. Almost four hours. So I turned it off. Turn it back on here. Yep, that green is fading out. It may not look so much on the video, but sitting here it's very dim. Four hours. This angle looks a little bit more clear. It's obviously raining out here now. Pump still seems like it's spraying pretty well. So maybe I'll just let it run. But you can tell from this angle, it's 
red. Yeah.